5 Amazon FBA Mistakes to Avoid Amazon FBA is a powerful platform for anyone who is interested in reselling. As long as you know how to pick a product and then market it to the right audience, you can make a lot of money in this way while hardly lifting a finger. But therein lies the caveat. If you know how to pick a product and market it. This is where some people fall down. And so in this presentation, we're going to look at five big mistakes you should avoid. Not testing the product. Part of the appeal of Amazon FBA is that you can start selling products without ever having to get them delivered to your home. If you don't own a warehouse, this is a big plus. The problem is that this can also make it tempting to start bulk ordering products without testing them. You can already see where that might go wrong. So don't give in to impatience. Test the products before you invest. Not reading Amazon's guidelines or the wholesaler's terms. In order to sell a product via Amazon, certain requirements need to be met. For example, it's your job to ensure that the products are packaged and labeled when they arrive at the warehouse. If you don't read this part of the policy, then you might not realize that this is a rule. And therefore, you might send unready items direct to Amazon. This can be an expensive, embarrassing, and messy problem to fix. Choosing fad products Fidget spinners are massive, right? Why not order thousands of them? Because fads don't last, as any reseller who made the mistake that time around will know all too well. Inventory mismanagement Buying too much of something or too little is a pitfall of any reseller business. It's just that it's a mistake that's even easier to make as an Amazon FBA seller, who never actually sees their own stock. Try to get a feel for the market and do some research before investing. And then make sure you have a steady supply at all times. Overpromising The desire to sell can sometimes be so strong that we make promises we can't keep. This of course leads to disappointment, bad reviews, and ultimately failure. Better then is to over-deliver by giving away something extra. Or by delivering in a quicker time than you promised. That's how you make happy customers. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.